I just watched Kavensky's comedy about Cassidy. He's actually saying that Cassidy pimps out his girlfriend um, and that she's on antidepressant medication or some sort of medication for her mental state, it seems. Um, it seems that there's, he's saying that, that, that she films videos for OnlyFans, but that's been commissioned by Cassidy. He wants her to do it and hands over cameras to people. And then he's saying that Cassidy's either into to, um, tag teaming his girlfriend with other dudes, or but but the guy said, "Hang on, I'm not gay." So I think what what um, the video is saying is that Cassidy is bisexual and wants to get it on with guys that that um, that come along and pay to spend time with Brittany. And then of course the guy said, "Where's my stuff?" Or he said, "Shit, where's my shit?" And Cassidy's in the video played by Eric starts sniffing really profusely. So I think I, I'm, you know, I stand by my original statement. I think he's saying that Cassidy sells cocaine as well. So he's making a lot of really serious accusations. But to me, the video is so crazy. I, like I say, last night I did videos saying that I believe it's all a boxing promo. And to be honest, the way this video presents, I, I, I just, I, I'm pretty sure um, that's what's going on, in my opinion. You can't be make this many accusations and act this crazy. Um, the video I actually think is pretty funny, and I think I think Eric um, does um, uh, do the like. Often Cassidy does that. He just walks up and goes, "Can I have a number, real quick, my chocolate queen?" And then says you're trifling when it doesn't work. So, to be honest, I think he played Cassidy really well. Uh, the guy that steals the show actually is the Asian cameraman. I love how he's stumbling everywhere and <laughs> on the beach. You know how he's how awkwardly he walks around. He just presents as a really funny guy. It's all sight gags, really, because he he doesn't really say all that much. He just sort of presents as a stumbling, mumbling sort of boob. And then I think it's pretty interesting that they're sort of presenting that with Cassidy's videos that the Asian guy is usually right there with the camera and everybody can see that it's a prank anyway. Um, so I don't know. Um, I, I, I think um, Eric's video is funny. I thought the bald patch was funny as a sight gag. And I thought it was funny that there's supposedly an incident where Cassidy lost his temper once and kicked all the removalist boxes around. So in the video, every time Cassidy has an anger fit, um, there's removalist box to throw around, even when he's in bed, you know? So <laughs> it is pretty funny. Um, so yeah, there's some funny humor in it too, but like I say, there's some pretty serious accusations, like, um, and the whole thing's just so bizarre that, as I say, I, I, I think it's got to be a boxing promo. So, um, it'll be interesting to see if the, when and if these guys box and if I've called this right. And then when they box, I'll be interested to see who even wins. Like, I, 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 it would be, I have to say, Eric's a big guy. I can't work out how tall he is. Um, so it'd be pretty interesting to see him fight anybody, actually. Um, you know, when I look at him, I don't know why. I can't help feeling he's done some wrestling before. But it, it might just be, I'm judging that purely on um, on, on on his appearance, which, which is... Um, I, I saw, I used to watch him when he used to lift weights, so I definitely know that a lot of his physique comes from uh, the weightlifting program that he's on, and I think he was openly on a steroid cycle as well um, on the on his program. So, um, but nonetheless, he still does look like a wrestler, so maybe there's some wrestling in the program there that he didn't really show. I don't know, but yeah, but, but that's not going to help much in a boxing fight, I guess, being a wrestler. Um, but I'd be interested to see him wrestle someone. I'd be interested to see him box someone over and out.